So I finally got Star Platinum the World. It took me quite a while to get it. And I'll be doing a showcase on it. Here's the star model. You can see compared to a normal Star Platinum the World, he has um, a beetle on his headband and stars on his gloves and boots. And make sure to stay to the end of the video. I'll be showcasing a really good Star, uh, Star Platinum the World boxing build. Uh, it's very unique. And yeah, uh, let's get into the showcase. Star Platinum the World! The world! Okay, so here's the build. I'll start with the uh, fighting style. So first it's the, uh, the usual, you max out your uh, defense passives for boxing. Okay, then you want to get the barrage, you want to go up to the um, the second upgrade. You don't want to get this because this takes too, ma too many points and uh, usually you don't get uh, the opportunity to rush for that long. And it's also very important that you get the muscle memory uh, passive because it will boost the damage of your rush from 2 to 3 damage. Now for your character, you want to max out agility as usual then uh, only get one sternness and very important as well to um, get the second to last well health regen um, point and then also the usual max out your health now you'll see why I had the in, in, enough points to uh, get those upgrades because um, it's just the normal skill tree. I'll it's a like destructive power. It's, um, it's in the shape of a star, but it's pretty confusing to navigate. Then I only got one. Uh, just just like the first unlock of combat precision because these take way too many points and of course you wanna get your moves and some the time stop and you see I I didn't get the last time stop mastery I only got this one because eight points you could get a lot of other useful things with those like my boxing tree and like the character character regen tree because when you're using um, the aura beat down, you have all that time to heal and like that passive health regen is going to be very useful combined with all your health and your defense passives. And then I also got the second uh, just stand jump one, uh, just stand jump upgrade one 
because stun jump's actually pretty useful. Sometimes you can jump on buildings to escape, uh, dodge some attacks. So I'll carry on with the skill tree. I think I showed these already. And uh, then you can go here. Get the aura beat down and the plan slam. And then these are just stand jump upgrades. Alright, yes, yeah, so I have also changed my Roblox username if anyone cares about that. And yeah, that's the end of the showcase. If you enjoyed, like and subscribe. See ya.